Hello. The average annual catch of squid in the United States during 2019 to 2023 was approximately one, one billion pounds. Do you know the process of catching and processing them? Please like this video to let Trending Farm explore with you right now. Squid play a vital role in the US marine ecosystem and serve as a significant food source for humans. Found in northeastern US waters from the Gulf of Maine to Cape Hatteras, North Carolina, they inhabit coastal regions with sandy or muddy bottoms at depths of 164 to 1968 feet. Long fringe squid prefer temperatures between 5 and 20 degrees Celsius, with an average size of 0.98 to 1.97 feet in length and weighing 1.1 to 2.2 pounds. During breeding and migration seasons, they form flocks of millions. Breeding typically occurs in spring and summer when sea temperatures rise, with baby squid reaching maturity in one to two years. The squid fishing season in the northeastern United States typically spans from April to October, with peak activity occurring between June and August. Squid fishing vessels are sizable, designed for safety at sea, accommodating numerous crew members and fishing gear. Constructed from steel or composite materials, the hulls are robust to endure rough seas and harsh weather conditions. Fishermen equip these boats with high capacity, energy-efficient fishing lights attached to masts to attract squid. Sturdy fishing rods made from steel or composite boast significant length and bearing capacity for hauling heavy squid nets. These rods are securely fixed to the deck and sides of the vessel. Durable synthetic fiber is used for squid fishing lines, resistant to abrasion and seawater, enabling casting to required depths. Pulleys mounted on rods and decks reduce pulling force, aided by winches and rotating equipment. Nylon mesh squid nets with small meshes capture squid efficiently while minimizing bycatch covering expansive areas for maximum catch potential. Once preparations are complete, the fishermen strategize the squid fishing process. It requires coordinated efforts on board to ensure the safe and effective release of the nets into the sea. Careful consideration is given to choosing areas with suitable water depth, while avoiding locations with reefs or underwater obstacles. With precision, the fishermen control the pulley system to lower the nets and fishing lines into the sea, ensuring even distribution on the seabed. Alongside, squid bait is strategically dropped to attract the desired catch. Typically, the nets remain submerged for a period ranging from 30 minutes to two hours before retrieval begins.
Using winches, the fishermen carefully and steadily pull the nets onto the deck where squid are harvested and any unintended bycatch, such as small fish, is released back into the sea. This meticulous process ensures both efficiency and sustainability in squid fishing endeavors. After pulling up the net, fishermen will classify the squid according to size and quality. Large, healthy squid will be selected to sell at a higher price. Small, weak or injured squid will be processed into other products such as dried squid and rimmed squid. The squid is cleaned immediately after pulling up the net to ensure hygiene and quality. The squid is pre-steamed and frozen, or directly frozen, depending on the intended use at a temperature of minus 18 DGC or lower. Do you see every barrel of frozen squid stored on the ship's deck? The result after a hard night for the fishermen, and now it's time to return to the mainland to take it to the processing factory. Incoming raw materials must be rigorously maintained at a temperature below 4 degrees Celsius. Prior to processing, the starting materials undergo meticulous size sorting and are immersed in ice-infused water tanks to maintain optimal temperatures. Following storage, squid are meticulously separated into tubes and tentacles by workers. Internal organs Bones, skin, eyes and teeth are meticulously removed during the cleaning process. Each semi-finished product undergoes thorough inspection to ensure the elimination of any remaining impurities. After soaking for three to four hours in barrels kept below six degrees Celsius, semi-finished products are meticulously sized and undergo a secondary inspection for impurities. Any presence of parasites leads to immediate product disposal. Squid are washed in two water-filled tanks before proceeding to chopping or slicing stages Once placed on trays, the product undergoes rapid freezing with a maximum freezing time of four hours before being packaged and transported to distributors, retail stores, or directly to customers. Squid can be processed using a number of different methods. Squid meat is a nutritious food with many health benefits. Squid meat is a rich source of protein and contains many important vitamins and minerals for the body, including vitamin B12, vitamin B6, selenium, phosphorus, copper, and zinc. Rich in antioxidants, good for heart health and supports brain health. Squid meat can also be used to prepare many delicious and nutritious dishes such as steamed squid, grilled, stir-fried, simmered, braised, fried, hot pot salad, With great uses and health benefits, squid meat is a food that should be in your daily diet. So how do you feel about this video? And do you think that in the future, a lot of machines are going to replace more humans? And how can we face that problem in the future? 
Uh, please share your comments down below as this is uh, going to be very, very important to know pretty much from almost everyone so that we can hear more opinions and uh, get introduced to more solutions. Thank you so much for watching this video. Don't forget to share, like and subscribe for more videos like this.